This is the Hover Air X1. And if you're looking for a drone that's value for money, super portable and easy to use, this is the drone for you. The guys at Hover Air sent us this a couple of weeks ago and I tell you, it has changed our life. As vloggers, everything, whenever you're doing anything, it takes longer because you have to record it. For example, when I take a wheelbarrow full of whatever down to somewhere else, I have to stop, put the camera, walk, come back, grab the camera, run down, put it back down. It's a whole thing, you can imagine. But with this, it just, make, it just made our life so easy and we absolutely love it. It's foldable, so it's super portable. It comes with a little pouch and two batteries. It only weighs 125 grams with the battery. So without the battery, it's super, super lightweight. And it's amazing. It's not like any other drone because this is a self-flying drone. So it has five presets and the custom one. And we'll go through them right now. Oh yeah. So it's super, super easy to set up. You just download the app onto your phone and then you can adjust some of the parameters of each of the flight paths, like how high, if it's near, if it's close. So all you have to do is turn on the hover air on the power button over here. You have to hold it for five or six seconds and the green light comes on. And then you open your app on your phone once you've downloaded it and click on tap to activate connect. And I click that and you click connect and you should hear a beeping sound and the light goes blue, done. You can update the firmware and also the guys at Hover Air, they create new flight paths. So the custom one, which we'll speak about at the end, um, they will in the future upload different flight paths and you can put it on to that custom setting. You can go on to hover settings and here you have the five preset flight paths. The first one is hover. And if you click on that, you have the choices of shooting photo or video. So you have shoot shooting mode, the duration, target tracking, vertical mode and video quality. Now the video is 2.7K it films in, which is pretty good for, for what it is. So switch to hover mode, you can switch it. You can switch it from your phone itself. And then you just press the start button. Continue. Hover. And off it goes. So when the red light comes on, it means it's recording video. So hover will just be right there in your face. <laughs> and as soon as you're ready from using it, you just put your hand underneath it. The light turns green and it lands safely in your palm. Now it does not have um, obstacle avoidance. They are preset flight paths. So just make sure that when you do get it, you're in a nice open space till you learn how to use it and understand the way the flight paths work so it doesn't crash into anything. Now the propellers here are encased in the box itself. So even if it does hit a branch or a tree or something, um, it, the propellers don't get broken, which is amazing. So next flight path is the zoom out. So I click on that and you can choose the distance that it actually zooms out to from 1.5 meters, three, six, or nine. So just make sure there's nothing. If you choose the nine meter one, there's nothing nine meters away. So I click on the nine meter one just there, switch to zoom out mode, zoom out, zoom out press the start, zoom out. put it there and let it work its magic. <laughs> 
so I put my hand under it and touched it before it was ready to land and the green light goes orange and tells you please be careful about the obstacles around and yeah don't crash it basically so thanks for that hover let's uh see what the next flight path is the next flight path i'm going to use is follow which is my favorite one because a lot of the time i'm carrying stuff and instead of like i said putting the camera down up taking it walking down back and forth just put it on follow and it follows me so follow you can choose the duration distance you can choose far close or standard i think we'll go far for this one and follow modes back figure altitude you can go high flat shot or low we'll go high for this one and switch to follow mode follow. we're gonna walk to our ruin <laughs> lights gone red good boy follow me mate Very easy palm landing. I love it. So easy to use. Now the battery lasts about 11 minutes. So this is already on one. So I think I'll change it over. Very easy to do. Just turn it off. And pull out the battery. <laughs> no surprises. It does come with two batteries, which is handy. It does come with a charging dock and you can put them both in and it charges the one that has the highest charge in it first finishes and then starts the other one and it takes about 35 minutes to charge one battery with the dock but if you can also charge it in the unit itself but it takes 55 minutes to charge this one but if you have both of them empty 55 minutes and you have both of them ready which is awesome the next flight path is orbit so the radius you can choose from four meters, two and a half, one and a half, or six. We're six meters away from the ruin. Let's do it on six. Angle you can choose from 360, 180, 1080, three rotations. Oh, that's cool. Let's do that one. I haven't tried that one yet. Altitude rise one meter, flat shot, or lower one meter. Let's go rise one meter and switch to orbit mode. Orbit that easy press the button that looks about six meters so it's going to go through around three times But it's pretty cool to give you a perspective when you're working or doing something. You just throw it up there.
last of the presets is bird's eye which is pretty straightforward goes up and comes back down so you have the rotation speed shooting mode altitude five seven nine or 15 meters let's go 15 and switch to bird's eye mode Okay, and we've come to the last one, which is custom. The one, this is my favorite one because it's um, dolly, so it follows you, but in front of you. It does take a little bit of time to kind of maneuver it just so it's always in front of you. Now, before we try that, there's a couple of things. One is each of these options has a vertical shooting mode. So if you want your videos in portrait for TikTok or YouTube shorts or Facebook shorts, um, it can do that in all the different fly modes. And a really cool thing is, which not, I don't think many drones do, it can use your phone to record the audio and it cuts out the sound of the drone. It also has a manual control, which would be under those custom settings, and you can actually fly it however you like. So there is that option anyway. But why do that when you can keep your hands free and use it like a, a little pet. <laughs> Comes, goes, shoots you this way, that way and the other. I love it. And go. and land in the palm of your hand like a good little pet <laughs> I have a pet bird <laughs> with a camera <laughs> awesome thanks again guys Hover Air X1 for sending us this it's really going to make our life easier being YouTubers or vloggers alrighty so if you want one of these beauties one of these flying pet birds <laughs> I think they have a Christmas sale on right now till the 20th of December. So you can check out the link below. It is really a lot of fun if you enjoy filming stuff and nature and the outdoors or if, if you have a vlog like us. It really, really makes your life so much easier. And it's great to get those shots that you wouldn't normally get without having to fly it yourself. It makes it so easy being self-flying. We absolutely love it. Thank you very much guys at Hover Air X1. Don't forget. Link in the description below. Hope you enjoyed this video. Take it easy. Bye bye.